What's up, guys? We're back, and I'm taking a look at some more NBA player props, this time over on Sleeper. You guys can join Sleeper right now. Link is down in my description below. Promo code DOMG. I absolutely love this app. We're going to dive in. this play. These player props today's video are available pretty much everywhere. Whether you're on Prize Picks, Sleeper, a player prop site, or a sportsbook, these props should be available pretty much everywhere. So let's dive in. Hopefully get some winners. I got two player props that I really like for today's slate. So let's dive in. Hopefully get some winners. Like I said earlier, if you guys want to join Sleeper, link is down in my description. Code DOMG can get you guys a first time deposit match. I believe up to $100. It might be even $500 right now. And on top of that, I believe they also give you a free square when you join as well. So a lot of offers right now over on Sleeper if you guys are interested in joining. With that being said, let's uh, talk about real quick before we hop in the Dub Club. The Dub Club is you guys can get every single one of the entries that I make sent straight to your phone. There's a two-day free trial linked down my description below. We've been absolutely killing it over the Dub Club as of late. We've had an amazing month so far. And I'm looking to make February an even better month. So if you guys want to join, like I said, two-day free trial is down there in my description. But if you don't know what Dub Club is, it just sends every entry that I make straight to your phone, whether that's for prize picks, underdog, parlay play, sleeper, chalkboard. All those different player prop sites, my plays get sent straight to your phone. You guys can join right now. My prize picks left in it winnings over $5,000. As you guys can see right there, I'm back to pull. I've been doing this for a very, very long time. So if you guys want to join, the link is down there in my description. But you can see that it sends my plays to you through either the Dub Club app, email, Telegram, or Discord. So if you guys want to receive my plays and get them sent to you, you guys can choose whatever option you guys want there. So uh, with that being said, though, let's get into today's video and what you guys have been waiting for. I will say, though, make sure you guys join the free Discord as well. There's a free Discord link down in my description. You guys can get some more free plays from me. Should have cast this one out, but the NHL tacos sold, unfortunately. But, uh, you know, what can you do? I mean, it's the prize based discounts. You guys can see some more free plays over in the Discord. You guys know when I live stream. I should be live streaming tonight as well, by the way. We're going to live stream some second half player props and take a look at uh, what I'm liking over there. Going to cook up some live plays. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. Have those postifications turned on so you guys do not miss that. That. and uh, I think this is pretty much going to do it. Play responsibly at your own risk. Give me a follow at, at, on Twitter at DMG Props, and let's get into it and hopefully get some winners today. All right, so the first player prop I like is going to be over in the Portland game here. We're actually going with both props in the same game here. So if you're on a sports book, you can do the same game parlay, but uh, I like these over on Sleeper today. Uh, so we're going to scroll down until we find... I'm uh, sorry, we don't even have to scroll down. We're going to go with Damian Lillard over 36.5 PRA today. Not anything too crazy right there. I mean, he's facing Portland today. He's going to be in Portland playing there today. And obviously, the motivation should be there. I mean, he's over some 55% of games already so far this season. As long as this game stays close, which I think Portland can keep it close. They've been doing pretty... They've been solid for the most part as of late. So I'm thinking they can hopefully keep this one a little bit competitive here. I'm thinking Damian Lillard should have a great game where, with just a crap ton of field goal attempts here. I mean, he's already seen 19 or more field goal attempts in, what is that, six of his last 10 games. And in games where he sees 18 or more field goal attempts, you can see that he is over this in 82% of games. He's just missed in his last couple of games here, which is which is why I think it's a little bit lower, but it's really because of bad shooting. He In those games, he shot 33%, 35%, 38%, and 29%. So he's shooting in a 30% in all these misses here. One game right there, he shot 29%. So I'm thinking Damian Lillard should be in a really, really nice spot. I expect him to see, hopefully, some competitive minutes, and I expect the field attempts to be there because he's facing his old team, Portland, first time playing in Portland. It's going to be a huge game for him, and I'm, just, I'm, I'm thinking he's going to be aggressive here. I think his teammates know that they're going to be aggressive or that he's going to want to be aggressive and uh, i think his field goal attempt should be there i mean it's a really simple breakdown i'm not i don't think anyone's really gonna uh disagree with me there but he already faced portland this year it was in milwaukee though he had 40 pra against them that was back in november and that was also by the way shooting 33 percent right there he had 21 field goal attempts last time against portland so i think he's in a a really, really nice smash spot here against Portland. The matchup's great as long as, again, the only thing I'm worried about is him not seeing his full amount of minutes if uh, Portland ends up getting blown out. But in like in games where he sees 30 more minutes, I mean, he's been pretty good. 58% as you guys can see right there. And that's not even factoring in the field goal attempts that he'll probably see. I mean, 15 plus field goal attempts with 30 plus minutes. He's over in 66%. So... I love the spot for Damian Lynch today. I just expect him to be aggressive. Guys don't fault me too much when I try to uh, take advantage of their motivation. And I think uh, Damian Lillard should be pretty uh, motivated today. So matchup's great. Motivation's there. And also, I believe the field goal attempt should be there where he has been very, very good this year. The only ways I see him missing this is the minutes not being there or if he just shoots really, really bad. So I think Lillard, though, should be in a very, very nice spot today. I expect him to do very, very nice with a PRA today. I don't mind the points either. The points plus assist, anything like that. Points plus rebounds. I just personally went PRA because it's got a better payout right now on sleeper. I don't think there's going to be a huge difference there, but it's a 1.79x compared to like 26 and a half points, which it was 25 and a half earlier. I think 26 and a half is a little bit steep, uh, but you have 32 and a half points plus assists. That's a little bit higher than it really should be. But then you have the points plus rebounds, which actually also got bumped to 30 and a half. So 
I just think that the uh, 36 and a half PRA is probably the best spot right now on Sleeper, in my opinion. So that's what I like right there. But moving on to player partner two, we're again going to go with the Portland game here because I like Malcolm Brogdon here over 20 and a half points plus rebounds here. I think the rebounds gives him a little bit more of an edge uh, than just the points, uh, which I liked him over 15 and a half last game he played. And uh, he absolutely smashed that spot. I mean, just last game, he dropped 24 points with five rebounds. He's, done, he's been doing really, really good with the rebounds lately, which is kind of why I'm going with the points plus rebounds here. But this entry here pays out about three 0.09x. I personally am locking these guys in different entries though, so I don't have these guys paired together personally. I will say that, but I locked in Brogdon last night and I'm going to lock in Lillard again today. Well, let's get to the reasoning here for why I like Malcolm Brogdon so much. So Brogdon's in a really, really nice spot. You can see what he's done in his last few games here. He's over since seven of his last 10 with one of those games there being a hook. He's also been over by the hook three times in his last 10 games. So do kind of take that into account, but really what I like so far is going to be his minutes here. I talked about this on live stream the other night on why I like Brogdon so much as of late, and they just still have not adjusted to his lines. The matchup against Milwaukee, by the way, is very, very nice for him as well. There's a lot of, uh, it really fits his play type, I will say. It, uh, Milwaukee's defense fits right into Brogdon's play type. Everyone is going to be on Simons today. I'm on Brogdon personally. But uh, take a look at games without Shaden Sharp here, and just look at his minutes that he's had without Shaden Sharp. He's had 25 minutes, and then other, all these other games, he's had 30 or more minutes, at least in his last 10 here. So I'm expecting about 30 plus minutes today from Mr. Malcolm Brogdon. If we take a look at games with, with him just playing 30 or more minutes, he's over in 83% of games this year. He should be a lock to see 30 plus minutes if this game stays competitive. And if this game does not stay competitive and it's a blowout, I mean, it's not 0 and 2 pays out the same as a 1 out of 2 when you have these guys paired together, Lillard and Brogdon. Because if, the, if these guys only see like 25 minutes in a complete blowout, I mean, these guys are both probably missing on the line. But if it's a close competitive game, there's a good chance that both these guys see a crap ton of minutes and have a lot, a lot of chances, which is why I like pairing these guys together in the same game. But Brogdon here at 20 FPR, I mean, 83% hit rate when he sees 30 more minutes. He's been seeing that in almost every single game without Shaden Sharp so far. He's out again today. I think he's in an amazing spot. You take a look at him at home as well when he sees those 30 plus minutes. He's only misses one single time against uh, Phoenix right there. So absolutely love the spot today for Brogdon. I personally have an eighth of a unit on him right now, but I expect that to be uh, probably about uh, 1.6 units by the end of the day, to be honest, or maybe a little bit lower than that. But I expect to be probably around one and a half units today uh, for me, Malcolm Brogdon there. But yeah, really some breakdown right there for Brogdon. Uh, he's been great without Sharp. You should see the minutes, and he's in a really nice matchup that I really, really do like here. So against Milwaukee last time, he saw 26 points plus rebounds back in November in about 33 minutes right there. He did have a crap ton of field goal attempts there, but he didn't shoot super great. He shot 30%. So uh, regardless, though, I really like him today against Milwaukee. Uh, but that's pretty much going to do it. Thank you guys for watching. We are not done quite yet, though. Make sure you guys join Sleeper if you guys have not already. Promo code DOMG. Link is down there in my description. Turn on those post notifications so you guys can see the live stream tonight or just join the Dub Club because my entries for the second half still get posted to the Dub Club. There's a two-day free trial link there down in my description below. We've had an amazing, amazing month. If you guys want to get in, I'm right below. You guys can see right there my night, my net winnings on prize picks here. I started with about probably about 100 bucks in my account about two years ago. And now, now I'm up over $5,700 on prize picks. So as you guys can see right there, we've been absolutely killing it. But I also want to show you guys uh, Props.Cash tool because this is the tool I used in today's video. You guys can get this tool for yourself. Link down in my description below. Promo code DMG gets you guys 25% off of your first month. Just uh, It's going to be 15 bucks for your first month there with that promo code DOMG. I've been using this tool for a very, very long time. Probably about two years now since I started on prize picks. And I absolutely love this tool personally. I seriously, seriously do. I've been using this every single day for about two years now. So if you guys want to research player props like I do, I recommend Props.Cash personally. Um, but you guys, can use that, you guys can use my promo code DOMG. OMG. Link is down there in my description. But with that being said, thank you for watching today's video. I'll see you guys in the live stream tonight and over in the dub club. Best of luck.